All right, welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Rejuvenation. Today we're going to be heading into uh, Talon's house and seeing what he has in store for us. Hey, Florin. Oh, hey, it's the um, trio and Ren and Talon. Mates, good to see you. Glad to see you're in good health and all. I'm glad to see that you're not a stone anymore. Uh, well, we already knew that, actually. It's been a while since we've seen Talon, regardless. Uh-huh, okay. Hello. How are things, Huey? I know things haven't been... Yeah, things haven't been kind of great between, uh, you know, Rune and everything, but... All right, glad to see Lavender and Raina are helping out. Uh-huh. The Seven Wonders of Grand Dream City. The what? The Seven Wonders of GDC. Uh, there are seven mysteries hidden about GDC that I'd like you to uncover and reveal. Uh-huh. Right. Mm hmm No worry, that makes no sense. Uh-huh. Split up into teams and investigate every single wonder. Makes sense. Talon's kind of an... Talon's an explorer, so makes sense that he's interested in that stuff. Uh... Adventurer, sorry, not explorer. Uh huh. A strange pelipper. If you put it in a specific mailbox. Okay. Fishing in one of the fountains will yield a secret. Uh huh. If you buy three specific accessories, three zinc to a certain grave, ordering a tea off the secret menu, taking the subway from Grand Station to Central Street. And then Central Street to Somnium Mall. Uh-huh. Visiting a central building rooftop during windy weather will unveil a secret surprise. Save that one for last, okay. And, okay. Ooh, since when was I involved? Well, Florin, you stayed inside the house, so that means you're involved now. Uh-huh. Okay. Mystery and Insomnia Mall first. Alright, sounds good. So we'll go ahead and do that. Uh, so we'll go ahead and uncover the mysteries. Which means we need to head over to the mall, which is right here. So yeah, Ren's here. We'll go we're going to have to go fishing in the fountain. Um, I'm going to save and let's see here. I think we should be okay. Kind of. Well, we should be okay. Maybe. Maybe I should give you... Oh, too late. Let's get fishing. Nothing happened. Guess this one's a fluke. Wait, there's something in the water. So yeah, you're gonna fish up a shooting star, which is a... Star me with boosts, basically. Um, I'm gonna start with roost gonna do that which is fine we have a uh, sturdy which is really nice but yeah we're just gonna deal some damage um good cleo first uh we'll go ahead and just throw chop here it's gonna surf hurts a little bit oh that's so close try attack it's gonna really hurt Oh, that's fine. Um, we can fake out for uh, the white herb and then dire claw. Oh, the poison is nice. Ow. I'm gonna go to Cupcake here. I'm gonna... Nice. Okay. So yeah, it's not too hard of a battle. It's a 6v1. It's not like a massive boss fight, but... That's a weird star me. If I was Robo Ren right now, I'd hop in and take a look. Uh, Robo Ren would break. Uh, Robo Ren can submerge. Oh, really? Uh huh. Okay. All right. So yeah. Um, a blue bead. Okay. Train station. Got it. Um. So yeah, your team's healed up. Let's just go ahead and... Oh, hello, Ren. What a surprise. I totally see you in there. Okay, you got me. 
Hey, thanks. Oh, hey, it's Amelia and Elita. Uh huh. Just saw so a move in and gonna hang out in the mall. Sounds good. Careful, Amelia. Uh huh. Yeah, Melia and Venom kind of have a complicated thing going on, huh? And they're gone. Yep. So yeah, uh, we're gonna go ahead and go to the graveyard here. Um, and here you'll see, if you've been here recently, you'll see uh, this whole thing going on here where Remembrance for the Fallen uh, people, right? Rune, Risa, Zara, John, and uh, Haz Hazuki. But yeah, the grave that is mentioned is this one right here with the blue candles. Um, I have the zinc bottle, so I'm just going to offer that up. Uh-huh. Elmita, I hope your life was full of happiness and love. So what exactly is supposed to... Uh, nothing. We're offering zinc. So yeah, she has a Stoutland uh, to start off. Um, I'm just gonna stealth rocks. This thing, they they don't. This thing doesn't really do much. Um, I'm just gonna brave bird for a bit here. Nice. Out comes Samurott. Uh, I'm gonna switch out here. Oh, Hydro Pump even missed. It's gonna Sword Stance, which is completely fine. Hey, there we go. Take this out. Out comes Samurott again. Nice, we got the burn. And KO. Ooh, haggy. Uh huh. We're just offering zinc bottles. Uh huh. So your sister who died loved zinc bottles. She took them for sickness. I guess that makes sense. Uh huh. It's not night. But anyways, uh... Alright. Me too. Glad we did this. Uh-huh. A weird Pelipper specific mailbox. Okay, sounds good. Uh-huh. And we got a pink bead. So there's these beads giving... Being given to us. Um, I'm gonna come here real quick. Oh yeah, I didn't mention it, but I did switch my Rillaboom for Skarmory. Um, not nicknamed yet. I should give it a nickname soon, but... Yeah, the weird mailbox is just right here. Uh-huh. Oh, hi, you Pelipper. Use it to harm your friends. What? I mean, farm your friends. That's not better. Disarm, misarm, shiz, frick. Mayday, bird brain, bird brain, bird brain. Uh... Uh-huh. Something fell out of the Pelipper. A purple ble bead. Okay. I should nickname this Skarmory. Uh, we're gonna nickname it... Um... Birdo, because I am creative. Uh, anyways. We'll head over to, uh... Beautifly's Boutique, which is actually down here, I believe, in the Dream District. Yeah, it's this one with uh, Risa's picture. Oh, sure, it's colorful. Uh-huh. This place is expensive, huh? Risa's Merch. They're trying to clear out Risa's Merch. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Uh, so we'll need to figure out what Risa wears. Um... Uh-huh. Ruby Red Streaks. Okay, so this one then. And, uh... Pinkish Red Coat and Dark Jeans. Got it. So we have this. 
we have this pinkish red coat and dark jeans. So how do you like it? It's it's everything I've ever dreamed of. Is this store real all mine? I just can't believe it. Uh-huh. Yeah, so at this point, Risa was already, uh, sick. Uh-huh. This is you, Risa. You've made it. Uh-huh. So this is where Risa's dream kind of expanded, I guess. I'm good, I'm good. Uh-huh. Take the train to Central Square, then Central Square to Somnia Mall. Alright, sure. Uh-huh. Okay. So, uh, another bead, huh? Sure. Uh, alright, we'll head over from Grand Dream City, uh, station. So here's Grand Dream Station. We'll head over to Central Square. And then you'll have to kind of exit and come back in. And then Central Square to Somnia Mall. Then we'll go ahead, exit, and it's just Somnia Mall. Yeah, maybe it's a metaphorical world. Uh huh, false. Alright. Uh, Mika's is next. On the back of the sign, congratulations, you have transported yourself to a new world. You went from the sh central square to the Dreams District Shopping Center. Look at you go. So lame. Alright. Alrighty then. Um, so, Mika's Cafe. Let's check out this here. Hey, Patty. Hi, Thumbs. Hi, other person I barely know because we've only been in a few screens of each other. Uh, let's see. Ren wasn't there at... She's never... Not Angie. And not Angie again. Yeah, so Ren's barely ever been... Met Patty. I guess when Ren was here earlier. Uh-huh, the secret menu. Oh gosh, okay. You guys waited your usual spot and I'll bring it over. Okay, here it is. The secret menu's particular tasting tea. Oh no. It's good, I promise. Well, bottoms up. Oh god. Oh my god. Uh-huh. And so yeah, they're serving us Sinisty. Which is a thing. Um, so you can catch the Sinisty. I'm gonna try to at least. There we go. Uh, it was terrible. Why would you serve Sinisty tea? On a scale of A to F, how would you rate your experience with this tea today? F? Are you kidding me? F, 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 F. Uh-huh. Zero to ten, how likely would you recommend this tea to your friends? Zero! Yeah, it said ten has a zero in it, doesn't it? Technically. Just want to let you know that Patty's destroyed you with logic and reason. Holy crap, am I hallucinating or is that Marie talking to me? Patty, what did you put in that drink? Huh? What are you talking about, Ren? I'm losing my goddamn mind thumbs. Patty is gaslighting the shit out of me. Oh, uh, okay. Uh-huh. He kind of did. Uh, yeah. Um, rumbly tumbly. Uh-huh. Top of the central building. Alright, sounds good. So yeah, Ren's gonna switch to Robo Ren, I guess. But we'll head to the uh, top of Grand Dream uh, central building. So yeah, you could have accessed this before, but yeah, if you head over to the 100th floor, um, you could have been up here before, but now we have the beads, so we can fill them up into the slots, and the door flings open. What the? Talon? You did it, mates. You conquered six of the seven wonders and made your way up to the rooftop of the central building. 
Yeah, the whole Seven Wonders thing was made up. No, now when you say it like that, it makes me look diabolical. The Seven Wonders of Grand Dream City just so happens to be my gym puzzle. So yeah, we, we were basically going through Talon's gym. Uh, we already beat Sota for the flying badge, but... I guess Talon wants to fight us. Um, yep. Yeah, Lavender kind of gave us the bead, so... And what about Mika's Cafe? Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> True. Yep. I mean, having a friend here is pretty nice. Uh-huh. Alright. Well, so that's it. When you're ready, you can just step on the... Uh, step on and... Get ready to fight. I'm going to put a normal gem back on. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need to buy more. Uh, stock up a bit more. So, what I do know is that he leads with a Hydreigon. Uh, not Hydreigon. Noivern. He leads with a Noivern, which is really annoying. So, I'm just going to lead Cupcake. Uh, Dazzling Gleam should just be a one-shot, honestly. So, that's what I'm going to do. I, I know his ace is a Mega Butterfree, so I do want to get Stealth Rocks up. If I can get Stealth Rocks up and I can get uh, um, Unburdened going, I should be in a really comfortable position. But I've, met, I've been curious about you since we met all the way on Terajuma. I reckon I'd take the time to see what you're really about now, now that you're in the neck of our woods. This isn't a battle for a bat or anything, but I hope you give it your all anyway. Right then. If it weren't for you and your group, I think I'd still be a hunk of stone. But that, not even stone can clip this bird's wing. I'll show you everything I've got. No holding back. Good luck to you, mate. Cartographer Talon with his Noivern to start off with. Um, I'm just gonna instantly, uh... Please don't get conf Please don't hurt yourself. Okay, that's fine. Um... Driftblim comes out. This thing is annoying. Um, oh, it's going to Tailwind, actually. That's annoying for sure. Uh, hurting myself is not great. So yeah, this thing has Acrobatics, which is definitely really annoying. Um, let's go to Birdo here. Uh, I want to set up Stealth Rocks. Oh, it missed its Willow. That's good. Um, kind of tempted to set up my own Tailwind. Uh, yeah, it's gonna willow, which is fine. My tailwind's gonna be offset by three turns, which is nice. It's gonna acrobatics. It doesn't hurt me too much. I'm gonna brave bird, which should do some. Oh, that's actually not a lot of damage at all. I can just let it KO itself through Rocky Helmet, actually. Oh, I should have waited to set up tailwind later. It's just gonna KO itself with, uh, Rocky Helmet. Um, how many... One more turn of Tailwind. I don't want it to set up Tailwind, so I'm gonna... I'm just gonna Brave Bird here. Nice. Out comes Oricorio. Uh, Revelation Dance will KO me, which is fine. Okay, I think here... I have, I have fake out acrobatics here with normal gem and unburden. I think that's what I'm going to go first. And then I can always have Cleo Ice Chard to finish it off. Um, so I think that's what I'm going to do. Fake out. So now I'm unburden. Unburden acrobatics should be really good here. Out comes Salamence. Oh, I really hope this is enough. Oh, it's not. Oh, that sucks. Uh, we should be okay, though. Ice ice Charge should be an easy KO here. Braviary comes out. Um, gonna Icicle Crash. Okay, that... Oh, that didn't KO? What on earth? That flinch was insane, though. Out comes Butterfree. I'm just gonna Ice Charge. Um, there we go. I don't think that crit mattered. Uh, I'm Life Orb Vival, so 
there we go. So yeah, not, not a particularly, well, I say not a particularly difficult battle, but this can give, definitely give you a lot of trouble. The sky field is one of the most, I guess, unfair fields against like a proper team. Um, Tailwind setting up strong winds uh, and things like that, but Stealth Rocks really, really helps here. Um, a lot of his Pokemon take, like his Oricorio and Butterfree just take up straight up half damage from Stealth Rocks. Uh, I don't think he has a way to remove Stealth Rocks either, which is, again, really nice. Uh, and then some priority just to get rid of Tailwind is nice. Unburden, if you have a way to out outspeed him, his Pokemon are not the most tanky thing in the world. Uh, but yeah, there we go. And it's done. Bravo, you truly are the better trainer. And the victor goes to spoils. My bird Pokemon were no match. I don't think there's a point in going on any further. But they fought hard and well. Can't say I'm upset. It was truly an honor, mate. If I could give you another badge, I would. Way to go, Thumbs. You were awesome out there. You are cool out there too, Talon. Don't forget about your efforts. Florin is right. You had, thumbs ha you had Thumbs in a corner for quite some time there. Did he, though? Did he? I still had my Omnibus Delphi in the back. Uh, that could probably just blue flare the Butterfree. Um, of course, the scary thing about Butterfree is that it can sleep powder. If it gets going, it can sleep powder Quiver Dance, and then it's really, really hard to stop it, honestly. Aw, oh, shucks. Y'all are too much sometimes, you know that? And with that, the adventure with the Seven Wonders comes to a close once again. I hope you all enjoy yourselves. It was fun, but I have to get back home and prepare for a gathering later. Thumbs and I will go with you. Thumbs and I will go with you since everyone's gonna meet up there anyway. Hmm. Okay then. Let's all head over together. See you all later. Alright. So that's another one down in the books. Thumbs strength truly is something remarkable. Yes. Yes it is. You told me when I first arrived in Avium that I would become a gym leader for more than two years. I think you would have thought I was insane. Truly. But... I think soon it'll be time for me to leave again. I'm still on my grand mission of mapping the entire world. That's Talon. Always having to be somewhere, never sitting still. If I don't stretch my wings, I may just forget how to fly. But I wouldn't dare leave my best friend while he's dealing with a troll that is his sister. So you'll have me around for just a while yet longer. Okay, sounds good. <laughs> Thanks, Talon. The future for me is uncertain, but when I'm mayor of Grand Dream City, everything's gonna change. When you're... Oh, didn't I tell you? With Cassandra gone, the city's gonna need a new mayor. I've submitted my application, and I'll be a candidate in the next election. Bloody exciting. In that case, then I'll be your campaign manager. Let's make a Grand Dream... Let's make Grand Dream City a wonderful place to win. The Eighth Wonder. The entire city itself. All smiles. And there it is. Um, that's a package. So yeah, we can uh, now interact here. Hey, you people. Hi, Thumbs. Uh-huh. Hey, Reyna. Kind of out of it. Uh-huh. Yep, okay. She's sleeping peacefully. Hey, Cannon. Uh-huh. Once I get over, aha. Uh -huh. So try me. Okay. Kiwi, I love Christmas. Uh huh. Yeah, it's gonna be rough for you. Uh. Kind of. Yeah. Uh huh. So yeah, uh, you can answer either one and then you can get the other one. You don't lose friendship or gain friendship points. Oh, well, actually you kind of gain friendship points, you don't lose any. Um, I didn't heal my Pokemon, but it's fine. I don't think there's a battle, but yeah. Uh, yeah, Melee and, Ven Melee and Venom have a complicated thing going on, but... Uh-huh. Sure. Everyone, may I have your... May I please have your attention? Thank you for coming tonight. I know this is very sudden of us, but Hugh and I have important news to share with you all. Ooh, just say it. My heart can't take another second. Well, Hugh and I have been thinking about this a lot over the past couple days. 
but Hugh and I are going to Hoenn for New Year's to be with my parents. Ah, that's great news. I'm sure you guys will enjoy the trip. Bring back a souvenir for all of us. Um, that's the funny thing. We won't be coming back. So yeah, those these two are just straight up dipping out of Avia. Uh, yeah, out of Avia. You guys are leaving for good? Yeah, but why? Well, I only came to Avium for Access High and I just finished my last semester. I applied for an internship back in my hometown of Mossdeep and I got it. As for me, I was only here because of Rune, but now she's gone. Honestly, the city just makes me think of bad things and I don't think it's healthy for me to be here anymore. So Lavender's parents invited me to their place too. Oh, Huey. It makes sense, but this really does suck. We're leaving on the 27th, so we'll still be here for Christmas. Well, you're always welcome in my house. If you ever want to visit, I'm just one phone call away. Thanks, Rodia. What about Saki, Val, and Adam? Uh-huh. Okay, so it's mostly just those three. Mm-hmm. Uh, Reyna? Hey, sis. Oh, hey, Ren. You doing okay? No, not really. Let's talk about it. Okay. Are you sad about Lavender and Huey leaving? They both first told me about it a week ago, so I had time to prepare. But hearing them announce it like that was not very comfy. Aren't you happy for them? Of course I'm happy for them. It's just... It just sucks, you know? I finally found some friends that actually like me. I know it can be off-putting to some people, and I get it. But the moment I make actual friends, they're just up and out like that. I know it's not true, but it really feels like they're just leaving to escape me. That's what my brain keeps telling me anyway. Reyna, that's not true at all. Anxiety is irrational, I know, but it's so hard to fight. You know you could just go with them? Go with them? Yeah. B but I can't leave Avium. I have to look after Mom. You know she isn't the brightest bulb. We had to uninstall our landline because she keeps giving telemarketers money. Mom will be fine. And, and what about you? Twins gotta stick together. We're bonded. You have to live your life, Reyna. You can't base your decisions around others. That bond isn't going away just because you're far from home. I'll be fine, and Mom will be fine. We're not going anywhere. And if you end up hating it, you can just come back. But uh, what about the prophecy? Oh my god, Reyna. Not this again. Just stop. F fine. Maybe... Maybe I'll ask. Can't just follow them without their permission or anything. But, um... They already asked me if I wanted to go. Are you serious? You love to be so dramatic sometimes, Reyna. Gotta keep things spicy. So, you good? Yeah, I'm better. I've never left the region before. I'm a little scared. You'll deal with it. You're stronger than you think. R Ren, what? Thanks. Yeah, yeah, listen. We've got a party to get back to, so... I, I need a few minutes to stop being such a messy bitch. You go on ahead. Alright? Damn. I got lucky with Ren being my twin. He always knows what to say. And there it is. Hey, uh-huh. Things work with Ren. His wireframe has dissipated. And thus, more of the file address left has been revealed. Which means Eren should be learning something new soon. Alright. Melia, tell Thumbs right now, young lady. Uh, Melia? What's going on? It's only three minutes. That's no time at all. Uh-huh. You spent three months worth of time up here. Uh huh. Melia, that's too long. Your mind won't be able to distinguish the difference in time. Once you start confusing your brain, you're gonna be in a whole lot of trouble. Uh. Well, no, it's meant for the interceptor. You're not supposed to be here at all. Yeah, there we go. Please put your health first. I guess she's also trying to escape death in a way, right? Uh-huh.
Talk to who? You called? Hey, Venom, thanks for coming. We need to talk for a bit. Do you have time? Okay. You sure you want to come with? No, it's probably best if I don't go with you guys. But that's okay. I have some work I have to finish up anyway. But hey, guys. If we leave now, we can get back here by tonight. Get there by tonight. Uh, thumbs about those files. Everyone said new letters appear in. Guys. E-T-O. Okay. I don't even remember the first three letters. You okay, Venom? I guess that talk wasn't great. Uh, oh, you're, we're back in Terajuma. So yeah, next time we'll... Uh... So yeah, next up is this little uh, area here with um, Terajuma. We're not going to do that next time, I don't think. Uh, next time we're actually going to deal with a side quest first. And then we'll deal with this after. Um, I think. Let me uh, double check the schedule that I plan. Maybe. Actually, we might do this first and then the side quest. We'll see. I haven't decided yet. Um, but that'll be it for this episode. I will see you all next time.